This is where I'll quarantine for the next 30 days. Gotta get that uh, fit to fly certificate before my flight. Some of the furniture that's real common here in Cambodia. I'll tell you, this is this is some solid stuff right here. I've seen this stuff uh, upstairs in other buildings. I'm sure it is no fun to move. Let's talk about comfort factor. Woo! Oh. There's a lot of this wood available. That's why a lot of guitars and other stuff come from here. They got a lot of good hardwoods, that's for sure. Anyway, look this up. A set like this would go for about three or four thousand dollars for the whole set. It's really not a bad deal considering what it is. How much wood's right there? And if you had a hard winter somewhere up north, you know, you could always. <laughs> Make some good firewood out of it. You know, whenever I see this stuff, I don't see any cushions anywhere. You know, I wish they put some cushions on it. Anyway, it's real common here. Of course, we don't have anything like that upstairs in our unit. But... Yeah, even the railings. It's just all over. Everything's real solid. Solid, man. Let's go upstairs. Yeah. yeah, man, everything's uh, pretty solid, including including this door. Let me show you. Put this down. Shoes away. Check it out. It's a solid door. Real solid. You know, they were jackhammering or something right down there, just right under the stairs here yesterday. And I heard it from in here, but until I opened the door, you know, the noise level, the noise level was pretty bearable but yeah everything here is pretty solid and it's hard to hang anything you gotta drill or use blue tack to hang stuff on the wall uh, we don't use drywall here man they, everything's poured solid so it's pretty soundproof it's not bad for as far as uh, apartments go if you have neighbors and stuff 